Postmark can be an amazing tool to use alongside your WordPress website. You see, WordPress is just not great at handling email deliverability. It makes use of PHP Mailer and most web hosts don't even support this anymore. And so if you have a WooCommerce store and your customers are not receiving email updates about their orders, chances are it's probably because WordPress is just not sending them out. Or, you know, perhaps someone has purchased a Thrive Apprentice product from you, but your customers are not getting their login credentials delivered to them via email. Again, this is probably a result of WordPress simply not doing a good job of sending out these emails. But enter Postmark, a service that relies on SMTP instead of PHP Mailer, and that sort of just overtakes email deliverability from WordPress to make sure that all of your emails coming from your website are successfully sent to your customers. So let me walk you through how to set this up on your website. For all things WordPress, make sure that you subscribe to our channel. We are a fantastic group of people here at Thrive Themes that loves WordPress, business, marketing, web design and development. And we happen to put out a couple of really cool videos each week. All right, two things that you need to do in order to follow along this video. The first one is sign up to Postmark. And do note that Postmark likes verifying each account that signs up. So expect to wait around 24 hours for them to approve your account before you can get started using it. But don't worry, you can still continue to set up your account while you wait for them to review your application. So, you know, keep on watching. All right, and the next thing that I would love for us to do is to understand the concept behind sender signatures. So sender signatures inside Postmark are the domains that you wish to use to send out your emails from. For example, take my blog. I have my own domain, which is lewistony.com, and say that I would like to use hello at lewistony.com or info at lewistony.com to send out all of my transactional emails. Before I can do this, I need to prove to Postmark that I'm the rightful owner of this domain. So how do we do this? Well, we're going to jump into sender signatures and we're going to create a new signature. Give yourself a name and whichever from email address you wish to use. And this alone already takes care of creating a sender signature, which again is a from email address that we wish to use to send all of our transactional emails from. But now we need to take care of the verification part. And to do this, we're going to jump into add domain, add the domain of our site, which in my case, it's just gonna be lewistony.com. And you will see how there's a couple of things that we need to do to show that we're the rightful owners of the domain and you know, enable Postmark to use our domain to send emails from. So Postmark needs us to add a couple of DNS records to our domain provider. So head over to GoDaddy or Namecheap or whichever service you use to purchase your domain and add in those DNS records that Postmark is providing you with. And once you've done that, click on the blue verify buttons that are there. And if you've done everything right, they should turn green. We're now onto the last step here inside Postmark and we simply need to create a new server or you can even use the one that Postmark automatically creates for you when you sign up. And inside your server, simply head over to your API tokens and copy the API token that Postmark has generated for you. It's time for us to jump into our WordPress website. And the first thing that you wanna do is install WP Mail SMTP. This is a plugin that is going to essentially connect your website with uh, your Postmark server. So once you've activated your plugin, head over to your settings and select the option to connect to Postmark. Here, you're going to type your from email address, the name that you wish to use, and you know the important step here as well is you're going to paste in your API token, the one that you copied from your Postmark server. Make sure that you test this whole thing out. WP Mail SMTP has this really cool functionality where you can send yourself test emails. And if you get your email, then congratulations. Uh, you have successfully bypassed WordPress as your email provider in our, and you're now using the most efficient email deliverability service for WordPress. I am down in the comment section in case you have any question. A big thumbs up button would be greatly appreciated if this video has been helpful. And yeah, I'll see you soon. I appreciate your time. Bye.